I'd lie to him and I'd say, oh, it's amazing. And then sometimes I'd tell him the truth and I'd go, eh, not that different. I just didn't feel like a black belt. And the truth is, I wasn't. Black belts train differently. They compete differently. They test differently. And until you've had those experiences, you're not a black belt. At test meetings, black belts test so much differently than guns. So instead of testing every three months, it's every six months. And then it's not a test, it's recertification. And competition is so much different. The things that uh, at tournaments that they would let slide when I was a red belt suddenly wasn't flying. I needed to make sure that I had my board set up right. I needed to make sure that I wasn't going to restart on my form because that's not allowed. It was so much different. I was talking to someone who, I, I was telling them this, and they told me, well, I got through that test. I made it through the test. I survived. That makes me a black belt. And I said, no, it doesn't. You haven't had those experiences. When you're testing, you're just a red belt trying to be a black belt. You can go on Amazon. You can buy a black belt. <laughs> 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 but then you're just, let's say you're a red belt and you go and buy that black belt, then you're just a red belt with cool belt. You don't have the experience of being a black belt. A while back, I was working with some red fours who were about to be promoted, and I was teaching them the new King on One Steps. I was shocked by their lack of control. I got really frustrated with them. I, I'd step in to work with them. I got kicked in the knee about four times that night. And I was complaining about some an emulator. And he said, that's because they're not black belts. They don't have the control of black belts because they're not black belts. They haven't been black belts. They haven't had the experience of testing and training and competing like black belts. I'm going to leave you with this quote. Who's heard the quote, a black belt is a white belt who never quits? Wow, that's it? <laughs> Y'all should all know that quote. I <laughs> so, the emphasis that we always forget about that, a black belt is a white belt who never quits. A black belt is a white belt who continues. If you don't continue, it's not really a black belt. That's why we wear midnight blue. Because the midnight blue, we don't wear black. Midnight blue represents and a never-ending desire to improve. Black is an ending, finality. So, you can always add color to it. You can always make it darker. You can always add more knowledge. So here's my challenge to y'all. Continue to add that knowledge to your belt. Continue to improve and continue to train.